It's Damien Jennings here, head coach of the University of Calgary, and we're here for the signing, the official signing of Mission Miller. Well, actually, we go back a year now, so watching a game, uh, coincidentally looking at someone else um, up in Edmonton at the Provincials, and saw, saw Mission and just saw the athlete and just saw the, the raw, if you like, athleticism, but at the same time, just, just great hands and a really competitive, kind of assertive approach to the way she played, so that kind of stuck out. And, reached out, got to know the family a little bit and watched some volleyball on long route just to be able to check in and here we are. Well, it's interesting, I've always wanted to sort of, sort of build a relationship a little earlier than later and I think that coming from Europe, obviously with a club model mentality which is a bit more development as opposed to just the kind of educational based North American approach, I've, I've wanted to try and create an environment where any recruits that we can get that are local or at least in a, in a close catchment area, they could come out a little earlier and train and get to know the players so that when mission starts in her first year, it'll actually be, she'll be way ahead of the curve. Uh, she'll be completely sublimated into our culture and she'll be working on some things basketball-wise at this level, she'll be exposed to it. Um, and even on her, just her recruitment visit in general and just checking in with the players and, and, and everyone else, she, she's got to know them very well. So we're already there. Now it's about some off-season summers and um, yeah, just uh, getting her acclimatized and ready for when she does start in 2025. Well, obviously, she's a wonderful athlete, um, particularly for her age. Um, basketball being a, a heightest sport in some ways, obviously, she's got just, just, just great genetics in that way. But um, it was the competitor, it was the assertiveness, it was, that, it was the hands, the hands were very creative. I'm sure there's a crossover in many sports that she's very good at. Um, but for me, the basketball side of it, it, it really was just her assertive, competitive play, great hands. Um, and it didn't matter who was around us, she was just a wonderful teammate and, I, and those things kind of stick out to me and that's what we're looking for in our Calgary Dinos and the fact that I now get five, almost six, maybe seven years of some work with her, it's, it's a real blessing. Uh, we're, not, we're not so positionally minded, I, I, do, I do really kind of in this development model idea for want of a better expression perhaps is, is perimeter and interior skills and you know, by the time they get to third, fourth, fifth year they're almost determining what kind of adult position that looks like so to speak. She clearly is a uh, forward at this level and she can be a forward guard at our level, I think, down the line. And uh, more importantly, she's got, she's got some interior experience and she's got good enough hands and good enough sporty instincts to be on the perimeter as well. So as long as we keep developing those, which obviously is a real benefit now to have her in in the summers, training with us for a little bit and getting exposed to the team. And we actually hope to get out to Europe this summer and uh, mission join us. So that'll be a huge advantage to her and us as a group getting to know each other. My name is Misha Miller and I go to Lethbridge Collegiate Institute or more better known as LCI and I'm a grade 11, I'm a forward and I play for the LCI Clippers. Well obviously it means a lot you know like getting my future secured at a good school with a great program and strong coaches, a strong environment, great girls and I'm super excited. Well I always sort of knew I was going to go with basketball because I knew that was a big question like volleyball or basketball with me but once I had a visit uh, up at Calgary and I stayed with the girls for a couple of days I knew I fit right in and they made me felt feel very welcome and it was just an awesome time so that was great and not only off the court off the court but also on the court they were competitive and they yeah it was I think my style of play also really fit in with how they played and yeah so definitely competitive I'd say I like my mental game is something I'm very like proud of I'd say and like just like my level of compete and my drive to work hard and I think is very matches very well with the UFC. Last year, considering we were basically entirely grade 11s and 10s, I think we did very well as finishing sixth in provincials and getting third place in our zone. So that was really good, especially with the number one team in the province right now, Raymond. I think we compete pretty well with them, to be completely honest. And this year, we are on a good streak. Recently, we won the Western Tournament up, in, up north in Calgary, so that was really good. And yeah, I'm excited for these next couple of weeks to finish off our season. I really hope that I can make an impact on the court, whether that, no matter where they put me, and I hope I can just develop my skills, not only inside, but also the outside game, and just all around, be, like, be an all around player, you know?